Hubert Hercatch versus Tommy Paul was the third quarter final for the Rome Masters for 2024. And both guys have been super impressive to get to this stage. Paul entered the tournament as the number 14 seed, and we get a buy in the first round. In the second round, he take on Karatsev. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6-4, six, 6-2. Six, in the third round, he take on Kopfa, who had just beaten Tiafo in the previous round. And again, no problem for Paul getting through in straights. 6-4, six, 6-3. Six, in the fourth round, he take the number two seed and defending champion Daniel Medvedev, who had battled to get to this stage. And again, no problem for Paul getting through in straights. 6-1, six, 6-4 six, to advance to the quarterfinals. Hercatch into the tournament as the number seven seed, and we're going to buy in the first round. In the second round, he take on Rafa Nadal, who was playing his final match in Rome. This is no problem getting through in straights. 6-1, six, 6-3. Six, in the third round, he take on Echeverry, and after a close first set, would we'll get through in straights. 7-6, six, 6-2. Six, in the fourth round, he take on Baez, who had just beaten Runa in the previous round. And after dropping the first set, Hercatch would fight back to win. 5-7, 7-6, 6-4 six, six, to advance to the quarterfinals. These guys have played two times before, with their last meeting being in Indian Wales last year, with Paul getting a three-set win, but they've never played on the clay courts, which is arguably both of these guys' worst surface. So it's going to be really interesting to see who comes out on top. If Paul's going to win this one, he needs to use the same tactics as he did against Medvedev because her catch is sort of, a, I guess, a worse version of Medvedev, but he still has that big serve as Medi does have sometimes as well. And he does move around like Medi as well. He can move around the courts. So got to use those same tactics that he's using against Medvedev and they should work. If her catch is going to win this one, he needs to serve big. If he can't use that serve, he's going to be in big, big trouble. So using the serve and try and get free points because Rome this week has been unusually quick. So he's going to have to use the serve and be a little bit more aggressive like he was against guys like Baez and Rafa. Great matchup. Didn't think we'd be getting this at the start of the week. You know, we had Medvedev, we had Runa in this section. Of course, Rafa was around, but I got it with her catching this one. I think with his experience at this level in this 1,000 stadium, you know, he's won two 1,000s. I think he might just get through in maybe a close three setter, but let me know down in the comments below who's making the semis.